I'll be presenting today's Radiopedia.org case in radiology, Lemire syndrome. Case courtesy is demonstrated here, and the case link is in the description below. Presentation, we have a 35-year-old male with a recent history of tonsillitis who presents with hypoxia. On CT, we see that the left palatine tonsil is enlarged, and there is an ill-defined collection within the tonsil itself. There is mild mass effect on the oral pharyngeal airway. There's also extensive thrombosis, here appreciated in the left internal jugular vein. We also see multiple lung nodules and a left pleural fluid collection. The patient was originally hypotensive upon presentation and required admission to the ICU for fluid resuscitation and vasopressors. Blood cultures were positive for fusobacterium. He was started on IV antibiotics. A repeat CT of the neck showed further progression of the thrombosis, and the patient was subsequently started on a heparin drip for anticoagulation. The source of the infection was felt to be secondary to tonsillitis. The patient subsequently had a tonsillectomy and and pathology revealed findings compatible with chronic tonsillitis. Following the tonsillectomy, the patient started to improve, anticoagulation was stopped, and he was provided with long-term antibiotics.